Hi Gemini, I'm Annette McKinley, this is Intuitive Astrology and Tarot by Annette, and I'm here to do your uh, love reading from now until June 30th, 2018. My birthday is June 22nd, and I'm running a birthday special. 30-minute readings are only $30, that's $10 off my normal rate. All of the information you need to book those phone readings is below. If you are outside of the United States, I can Skype. Um, and again, this is a general reading. You may or may not resonate. If you would like a more personal reading, again, you, you'll want to book a private reading with me. Um, and let's get started. We're going to do things a little bit differently here. Um, we're going to get one Oracle message and then do the reading and then bring in some Lenormand messages for you, Gemini. Um, this is for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus from June 16th until June 30th, 2018. Spirit, what do you want to share with Gemini regarding their love life between now and June 30th, 2018? If you're in the Milwaukee area, I do in-person readings. Um, please email me for more information on those if you happen to be in the Milwaukee, Wisconsin area. Brew City, whoop whoop, shout out to my peeps, <laughs> my fellow cheese heads. <laughs> All right, what does Gemini need to know about love between now and June 30th, 2018? Okay, let's see what uh, your overall message is going to be here, Gemini. Ooh, the griffin, honor and good luck. Very nice. That is your overall energy. Good luck is finally coming your way, Gemini. We shall see, we shall see. Okay, so... Let's dive into our reading. What can Gemini know about love between now and June 30th, please, Spirit? General love reading for Gemini, June 16th through the 30th. We had the Wheel of Fortune jump out. We're keeping that. What can Gemini know about love between now and June 30th, please, Spirit? What do you want to share with us? Okay, so you have the Wheel of Fortune, you have the King of uh, Pentacles, I'm sorry, the King of Wands, that was the King of Wands, Bastoni is Wands in Italian. I speak French better than Italian, <laughs> this deck is in Italian. Um, and then you also have the Knight of Wands. Two of Pentacles. Um, the Nine of Wands. The High Priestess. And you have the Eight of Pentacles on the bottom of that deck. So you've been working really, really hard, Gemini. Um, someone's been very focused. They're mastering their craft, mastering their skills. Um, when it comes to learning lessons about relationships and yourself and your own self-development and growth, um, and things are going to be turning in your favor, honor and good luck are on your sign. That is the oracle message. It's the griffin. Um... You've got the Wheel of Fortune here. Um, this is uh, fate, karma, destiny. Things are finally going to turn in your favor. You've been through some horrible stuff, some bad luck, bad times in love. Things are going to get a lot better. And you, you feel this coming. You're very intuitive. we got the High Priestess here. This is Water Sign Energy, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. This woman keeps secrets. This is Mother Maiden Crone. She's very wise. She is guided by spirit. She is spiritually 
aligned. Um, she keeps things to herself. She has that inner wisdom and knowing. She has a very strong intuition that she trusts. So you know things are going to get better for you. Um, I feel like things are going to be more in balance for you. We've got the Two of Pentacles. Earth sign energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I feel like you've been, you know, weighing things out, reviewing things, trying to bring balance into your life after going through some struggles and hard times and love. And um, you're you're doing you're doing things the right way. Your 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 heart and uh, mind are in balance. And you've been through a lot of struggles because we've got the Nine of Wands here. This is Fire Sign Energy, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. This could have been someone that you've been dealing with. Um, they might have fire in their chart or you might have fire in your chart, but you've been through a lot. Possibly suffering through some depression, but you're not giving up yet. You are not giving up hope. This battle is not over. You're going to fight. And you're going to come out on top and your burdens are soon going to be lifted. Um, I feel you're, like you're going to be um, hearing from a fire sign person. We've got the king of wands here. Again, fire sign energy, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. This could be someone that you already know or someone that is coming towards you. Um, this person is very fiery, passionate, creative, um, Strong business leader, very entrepreneurial. This king gets what he wants. Um, and he's going to be solid and grounded. Um, he's looking for a partnership, life partnership. This is not a knight. This, this, the knight is usually, uh, the knight of wands is in and out type of one night stand energy usually. Or someone who's very flighty and flaky. This person is uh, established. Very well to do. And I think they might be a little bit younger than you. We've got the uh, Page of Wands right next to him. So you could be receiving some fiery, passionate messages from a younger fire sign person. Again, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Something that's going to be a new spark, a new beginning for you in love, possibly. Something that's going to make you feel really uh, fiery and confident and passionate again. If you've been feeling down on your luck when it comes to love or coming out of a bad situation, um, things are going to turn in your favor very soon here. Um, so let's validate um, the Wheel of Fortune and the High Priestess for you. Why is the Wheel of Fortune here for Gemini? Got the magician. Things are manifesting. You've been working with the law of attraction or someone around you has and uh, you're manifesting things to turn in your favor. You've got all the tools at your disposal as above, so below. Making it happen. This is also Aries type of energy. Why is the magician here? Nine of Cups, Wish Fulfillment. You are manifesting wish fulfillment. Water sign energy, emotional wish fulfillment. You're going to be emotionally fulfilled. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio type of energy. You're going to be feeling really, really good very soon here. You're going to be coming out of this rough patch, Gemini. Why is the High Priestess here? Got the Knight of Wands. Gemini, you're an air sign. Fire, a fire sign person would be amazing for you. Um, be perfect to balance you out. So I feel like there's a fire sign person coming in for you. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Um, just be careful. Um, you know, don't, don't feed into any one night stand flaky in and out stuff. You need something more solid, stable, and grounded. So, um, but there's going to be some, some hot stuff coming your way. Very good. All right, so let's get you some Lenormand messages, Gemini. Love and passion and adventure are coming your way, Gemini. This is exciting. 
Can I have three messages for Gemini, please, Spirit? You guys have to let me know. Please like, comment, share, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Don't forget to take advantage of my birthday phone reading special. That ends on June 30th. My birthday is June 22nd. Send me good juju. Okay. Gemini. Let's see what, what messages. We've got the moon. As I'm recording this, it is a new moon in Gemini today. This is June 13th. Set your intentions out. Start manifesting. We have Fox. Ooh, and snakes. You need to be careful. Be careful what you're bringing in. Make sure your intentions are very clear. Um, I feel like you have been deceived in the past. Someone was keeping secrets. Um, watch out. We've got a snake, we've got a fox, and we've got the moon. Trust your intuition. Be careful about who you let around you. Someone could be sly or sneaky. The snake is also phallic. So beware of this Knight of Wands energy. Make sure this person coming into you is a king, not a page or a knight. You're going to be getting messages. Be careful who you let into your space and who you let into your energy. If you're very aware and discerning, you can have a good time. Good things will come your way, but be very careful. Okay, that's all I've got for you, Gemini. Please let me know uh, what happens. Until next time, namaste, love and light to you. Good luck.